Hello everyone and welcome back to Wicked Art. It's Wicked here and it is Tiny Tuesday. Uh, again, usually Tiny Tuesday is reserved for our younger audience, but if you are older and just want to draw along, that is fine too. Okay, so just grab yourself a pencil and an eraser and we will get started. We're going to draw a little Among Us character today. So, first thing we're going to do is we're just going to start with the faceplate. Okay, so I'm going to sketch out kind of a rounded rectangular shape. shape. So we're going to go in and we're going to refine our lines. Okay, so we're going to make some nice solid lines going around. circle right below it like that all right 
right, so now we're going to do, just because we can, it's a simple form, we're going to do a little bit of shading, okay, so I'm going to start back here, now if you notice, I'm doing these hatching lines, so they're just some straight up and down lines on here. So what you want to do is then cross hatch towards the back so that area is a little bit darker. Okay. So once you have that color variation there, we can kind of start with a dark color and then you want to lightly pick your pencil up and work your way out. Like that, so see how that makes the leg a little bit more 3D. Alright, so I'm gonna do the same thing with the visor. Okay, we're just gonna make these hatching lines come out, and we're just gonna follow that shape off the bottom of the visor. Okay, so I'm just gonna continue to hatch across. hatch by just changing directions and going the other way and then I'll darken that area up so it helps set you up okay so now when we put that in there now I can start with a darker color towards the back edge Think of it kind of like a, a dark gray. Okay. And then again, just like we did before, we're just going to lightly pick up our pencil as we work our way out. Just so it's lighter. Okay, I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm just going to go lighter as I work my way up. That way it's a nice even transition and blend. Okay. Now, I'm going to do the same thing on the back edge here. So I'm going to hatch in. Just this back edge part. shading you gotta learn how to control your pencil pressure okay and then as I work my way up I will lightly pick my pencil up as I go and just make it lighter and just give a nice soft blend sunlight's coming in this way, we're not going to see a whole lot of light. So just for 
interest sake, I'm going to add in a little line here just so we can see the curve. But we're going to hatch this whole back area. Now again, if you wanted to color this, um, you could probably use colored pencils the best over the top of your shading. Hatch. Go the other way. Okay. So again, we're going to have this part that's completely blocking. We're going to make that area darker. shade, but I will just get lighter as I go. Okay. Now, the last step is a step you don't have to do, but again, you know me, if you've watched any of my videos, I like to give my little characters a thicker side edge. Just to make it pop off the page a little bit more. Okay. So like this part here, I'm not going to thicken it, but I am going to re-refine it just because that shading kind of made it fade. videos are meant for more people who are, you know, they're just learning how to draw or they're a younger age and don't really have that <laughs> time or patience for long tutorials. So if you're ever watching these Tiny Tuesday videos, please just keep that in mind that they're <laughs> designed for that purpose. I uh, also wanted to say, take a little time say thank you. We're up to 30 subscribers. That's awesome. Uh, to me anyway. I know it's not as big as some of these other things, but I am very appreciative of the 30 people that are here, whether you're watching or you just like to listen along. I appreciate that, and I appreciate you. Again, if you have suggestions for anything, whether it's Fun Draw Friday, Tiny Tuesdays, or just an art lesson, please feel free to leave a comment, like, subscribe, share it with your friends. You can share your work with me on Twitter at Wicked Art 5. But either way, if you're just here to have fun and draw, that's cool too. That's the purpose of this channel. It's just for you to have something to draw and have fun. So I hope you had fun. I hope you learned something. And until next time, I will see you in the next one. So keep on sketching. Bye.